We are here for SmackDown Live tonight, WWE 2K17 My Career Mode. Kevin Owens stepping into the squared circle again with Mick McKay. Opening up the show of SmackDown tonight. We saw in the last episode Mick McKay calling out John Cena and now we are in a rivalry with the face that runs the place but Mick McKay looking to pick up another win over Fido and Spite. So do me a favor and leg drop that like button like your name is Hulk Hogan. Comment down below with what you think about these videos. And if you're new to the channel, subscribe for more. It's Mick McKay trying to come out of the gate. Kevin Owens taking it to Mick McKay. Hope everybody's doing all right today. I changed the time of my videos. Uh, I'm sure everybody that is subscribed to my channel has noticed that all the new career mode videos have been dropping at 8 o'clock simply because I have a brand new job. I know I've said that a couple of times, but I do. I have a brand new job and I've been working a lot of hours here lately, 12-hour shifts every day. I haven't really had a lot of time to do much. So I scheduled my videos to drop after I get off of work so that I can, you know, promote them a little bit. And get people's, you know, get people looking at them, things of that nature. You know, it's tough running a YouTube channel and working a full-time job at the same time, but I am doing my best and working my ass off to deliver Mick McKay action to everyone that enjoys him. And to all the people that are my friends that are watching, I, am, I apologize in advance for not being able to do live streams lately, not being able to get online and play with, with my friends. And, and to everyone, I am sorry, I apologize. I will soon be getting back online though. And hopefully we can have some matches and you know make some compilation videos or something and that goes out to anyone that wants to wrestle Mick McKay or Western Chris Danger or, or anybody like that you know just wanted to you know let everybody know in advance what was going on with me and why I haven't been doing a lot here lately except for my career videos as Mick McKay is defeating Kevin Owens in a upset fashion so far in this matchup taking it to kevin owens Ooh, trying to go for that knee there but oh oh it's not working oh he, the look at the irish is not working for me tonight Cha! take a clothesline eat it oh man i am tired as crap i'm recording this video after i got off of work oh god so yeah, I'm a little wore out right now, but that's okay. I'm, I said I got to keep these videos going. I might, I, quite possibly, after this year is over with, or, or you know, maybe in the next few weeks, I might be switching to every other day dropping a 2K17 video instead of every single day. I mean, I'm trying to grow my channel, so I, I like to, to put new content out there every day. You know we're doing we're doing a fantastic job we are growing faster than i have ever grown we are over 150 subscribers well over 150 subscribers by now we're on the road to 200 and hopefully shortly after that we will be on the road to 500 and hopefully by then you know i can take suggestions on what we could do for 500 subs you know. last time I just did a shout out video I'm not going to do a shout out video every time I get to a different hundred like 200 300 400 nothing like I'm not doing all that 100 was big to me as the referee is counting Mick McKay going after Kevin Owens referee pushing him back giving Kevin Owens some time to rest but I'm probably gonna do like a 500 and then a thousand and then from there I'll probably go like five thousand ten thousand if I make it that big there's no guarantee that I will ever even make it to 500 I mean I hope I do I mean you know I'm trying my best but my problem is I don't get a lot of people commenting on my videos 
I don't get a lot of likes. So I'm either doing something wrong or maybe people just aren't watching long enough to to even know what I'm saying or listening to what I'm saying. So so I don't know. But we're gonna try our best to whoop everybody's ass. And to make the best possible videos we can make for you and make it a great success. And just remember, I do return the comments. I'm not going to ignore you like a lot of YouTubers. Kevin Owens out of reversals. Oh, but he just kicked Mick McKay right in the freaking chesticles. Oh, there's that cannonball. Mick McKay getting out though. Son. You should know better than to be taunting me, be showboating. You do a cannonball, you get the upper hand, and then you showboat. And for that, I'm going to give you a dream killer. Oh, he is in perfect position for the flying Scotsman. Here we go. Ooh, oh, Owen's rolled out of the way. You a-hole, how dare you? Oh, I don't think so, Owens. And another tornado. D, D, T, nuts. Mick McKay up on the top rope again. Uso splash. A big Uso splash. And now, gonna give him a second dream killer. I'm not even going to do it. I'm going to go for the pin here. Here we go. One, two, three. You got to be kidding me, ref. Come on. Will you learn how to count, you son of a bitch? But, uh, yeah. I ain't got enough energy to run or I'd take that son of a bitch out. Yeah. Oh, he's not doing nothing. That's crazy. Asshole. Come on, man. Get up on your feet. Don't let Kevin Owens punk you like this. Mick McKay loves the tornadoes. Referee, what the fuck did I tell you about counting? You either learn how to count or you're going to get more than more of where that came from. Get in the ring. Dumb some bitch. Uh oh. Kevin Owens. He diverted the chair shot. And oh, we just suplexed McKay onto the chair. You bastard. How dare you do that to me, okay? I'm the leprechaun. I'm gonna steal your soul. Oh, maybe McKay grabbed his fat turkey leg and jerked it right out of socket. Alright, that's it. It's time. Oh, oh, really? Really? You're going to get up that fast on me? That's okay. Take a double X handle. And now I really am going to give you the flying scutsman because I'm the man. And I hit it. Yes. Very nice. How much? How much for the flying scutsman? Yay. I don't even know if I'm going to call it that. That's what I've been calling it, but I'm thinking about changing it. Not real sure though. I've just been so exhausted lately. I've been having a hard time coming up with anything fresh. And we all we never know what's gonna happen with Mick McKay. We never know what kind of character change he's gonna go through. We just never know. I had some people tell me that I was saying Scotch Irish, and that's not the way you say it. You're supposed to say Scots Irish. S-C-O-T-S, -S. but quite frankly, I did a lot of research, and you can say it either way, so, you know, I'm going to say what I want, because this is America, I don't have to be all proper for you, I mean, why would you even make a big deal out of something like that, Scotch-Irish, Scots-Irish, I mean, to me, personally, I, Scots Irish. It just doesn't roll off the tongue. Ooh, there we go. Alabama slammer there from Kevin Owens. McKay might be in a little trouble here. But 
but Scots Irish does not roll off the tongue right. Scotch Irish, to me, makes more sense. It rolls off the tongue a whole lot easier. Oh, he went for the pop-up powerbomb, and McKay made him pay for it. And he hasn't even put him away with that flying Scotsman, so maybe a Scotch hangover will put Kevin Owens to bed. Go for the pin. Come on. Put this guy away. One, two, three. And there is your victor. Did you doubt it in any way that Mick McKay was not going to win this matchup? I didn't. Even though Kevin Owens has beat me here lately. The only man to beat me besides Hideo Itami. But John Cena is nowhere to be found on the SmackDown card, so I'm assuming we're not going to see him tonight. Triple H obviously gave John Cena the night off. So, I'm sorry, but no Super Cena. At least on SmackDown. We'll probably see him on Raw, though. But that's where we're going next. We're going to Monday Night Raw. All right, so Monday Night Raw tonight, a rematch from SmackDown. What you just saw, Kevin Owens, Mick McKay. But John Cena is taking on Rusev in tonight's main event. The WWE Universe is jam-packed tonight. We are in Indianapolis, Indiana. And they are going to get their money's worth tonight because they have a double main event. Mick McKay, Kevin Owens, Rusev, John Cena. Will this rivalry start to get a little warm here as Brock Lesnar is taking on Stardust? That is a, uh, yeah, a, I don't even know what, what to say. That's just, that would never happen. I mean, come on. Brock Lesnar versus Stardust. You tell me that this video game cannot generate anything better than this. They must have put Kevin Dunn's brain into the PlayStation so that he could book the matches for Monday Night Raw because this sucks just like Monday Night Raw does in real life. So I don't know. Obviously, if Stardust had won the match, I probably would have just took it, put it back in the case, took it outside, and burned it. The Vaud Villains versus the Usos, though. And, of course, they lose, just like they do on SmackDown. Well, that looks interesting right there. Slater loses to Jack Swaghead. Randy Orton picks up a victory in the Fatal 4-Way. Yay! Mark Henry defeats Tyson Kidd. And Kane. God, somebody hates Kane because they got him in a freaking one-on-three handicap match against three of the strangest partners I have ever seen. Sami Zayn, The Miz, and Big Show, yeah. That's a Kevin Dunn booking right there. You definitely, you're definitely right about that. But Mick McKay, Kevin Owens, John Cena, Rusev, we're gonna get right into the match. I don't know what's gonna happen between Mick McKay and, Rus and John Cena tonight. I about said Rusev. Wow, that shows you how exhausted I am. I don't even know the difference between John Cena and Rusev. Well, okay, so I know I haven't been putting a lot of entrances on my videos here lately, but here's a little side note. I was the first one to come out as I was watching the entrance. Before my music started, Kevin Owens' music played for a split second, and then it switched to my music, and I came out, and then Kevin Owens came out, so I thought that was pretty cool. But Mick McKay and Kevin Owens gonna get it on one more time for your viewing pleasure. And Kevin Owens, oh, elbow reversing the choke slam. Yeah, the choke slam. Hmm. My name is Cleveland Brown, and I'm the place to be. Hey, you don't choke me right there. Get off of me! Is this the way? That you treat Morgan Freeman. You're gonna, you're gonna try to kick the snot out of Morgan Freeman, even though I helped you escape. 
escape prison with a rock hammer. Get off me, Kevin Owens. Why don't you go eat some fucking bacon or something? I mean, damn. Ooh. Take a knee to your butthole. That's what you love. You probably love when people put things in your bunghole. Kevin Owens don't like to be fisted. He likes to be footed. Oh, yeah. I actually like Kevin Owens, though. One hell of a wrestler. I just like giving people a hard time. And take a little bit of the flag. Who's the man? I'm the man. I think it's about time to redo Mick McKay's physical features a little bit. Maybe get rid of the high knee a little bit, the upper thighs, and work on the arms a little bit more. I don't know. I kind of hate the fact that you can't adjust each individual part like you could in 2K16, but, you know. Oh, that was nice. I didn't see that coming. That coming at all. Huh? Oh, that hurt my my stomach muscles. Stop pointing at me, man. Damn. Oh, yeah. Oh. Get out. Uh, yeah. Get in there. I said no cameras. You don't take pictures of me because I'm the freaking man. I gotta change that taunt. That is the dumbest shit I've ever seen in my life. What is Kevin Owens doing? I wanna see what the authority challenge is. Put on a four star match or better and lose to Kevin Owens. I know it probably sounds like my uh, nostril is kind of stopped up a little bit so my voice probably sounds a little different I, I think I'm starting to get borderline sick maybe just sinuses or something I don't know exactly but my nose has been running for about an hour now so maybe it's just cold weather I don't know but it sucks because it makes me sound like Steve Urkel did I do that oh, oh. I'm sorry. I kind of sound like what Steve Urkel and Cleveland Brown would sound like if they had a love child. No, I did I do that? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh my God. Get off of me, Owens. God. Why don't you, Kevin, blow on something? Why don't you go blow Chris Jericho so that he'll be your best friend again? Hey, you don't try to kick me, you a-hole. JBL, oh, I hope you like that. Oh, oh, uh oh, uh oh. Hey, hey. Don't you ever stand that close to the ring again. God, you must be the dumbest son of a bitch alive. But you sure are fast. Oh, God, he didn't quite get all of that. My God. Yeah, my nose is really stopped up. I got phlegm in my throat. Another amazing singles contest. These two never ceased to It just doesn't make for good audio when you can't even hardly talk. But it could just be, you know, the fact that I've been working my butt off getting up at five forty five every morning, working seven in the morning to seven at night. Oh trio woe. And then a drop kick. And a dream killer, dream killer. Here we go. McKay to the top rope and yes. How much? I like it very much. I'm not putting on a four star match and losing to Kevin Owens. You, you gotta be out your damn mind, boy. That's the only voice I can do right now is Cleveland Brown. <laughs> Hey, Peter, get over here. You remember that time I we went back to 1985 and you stood there and you went, dun, 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 dun. yeah, yeah. That was the reason Loretta left me. I'll make sure I get you in the future. Oh, 
Because my name is Cleveland Brown. Mitt McKay taking it to Kevin Owens. Yeah, elbow to the back of the hod. And a modified swinging, weird looking neck breaker thingamajig. Whatever. Oh! I bet that hurt, didn't it? I bet you won't ever do that again. Eat some stairs. Kevin Owens, you are not fighting back at all, and I don't understand. I don't understand why. You're better than this, man. Come on. You're be Oh, shit. Gonna, oh, glitch there. I mean, you're better than this. Oh! Oh! Oh, my knees. Kevin Owens, will you stop having a seizure? Damn. What the hell? Why are we sliding across the floor? Come on. Asshole. Referee's like, I'm not going to count from seven to eight. I'm going to wait 20 seconds and then count. Get up. McKay's going to lose. And it's over. So Kevin Owens strangling himself with the top rope right now. Picked up a victory over Mick McKay. But I did the authority challenge. I put on a four-star match. And I lost to Kevin Owens. That could move me up in the rankings. I don't know. I have not discovered yet if you move up in the rankings if you kiss Triple H's butt crack. Okay. I, I don't know yet. I don't know the answer to that. Maybe it'll happen. Maybe it won't. I don't know. We're about to find out, though. Because... This screen is probably going to take at least 30 seconds to load. So while it's loading, I can let everybody know that I really appreciate each and every single one of you that have been supporting me. We are growing faster in the past month than we did the first two months we were a channel. And, and that's awesome. I mean, you just don't know how much that means to me. As Mick McKay is here with Renee Young. You two met face to face in the ring tonight. What is the goal of that? Uh, no. We, I didn't meet nobody face to face, so. I, I don't know. I don't know what that means. But he needs to know who the big dog is in town, and it ain't Roman Reigns. He's got some stiff competition. And when I say stiff, I mean stiff. But he needs to know that I am the biggest roadblock for him and his Intercontinental Championship. John Cena, be on notice, brother. You're not taking my spot. I'm taking yours. So let's see who owns this yard, me or him. Well, since we didn't go face to face, I would say I own the yard. But most likely what's going to happen is now we're going to go face to face with with John Cena. And that's probably why that interview happened. I don't know why. I don't know. But what we're going to do though is we're going to wait and we're going to put that on the next episode and open the episode up with that maybe. I don't know. It might make the list and it might not. But thank you for tuning in. We will see you next time. Like, drop that like button. Comment down below. And if you're new to the channel, then hopefully I have earned your subscription for my WWE 2K17 channel. Everybody have a good evening. We will see you on the next episode.